He was chief shepherd. But before that, the Vatican watchdog. Being elected as the Bishop of Rome, Pope Benedict XVI, then known as Cardinal Joseph Ratzinger, served the church for 24 years as the head of the Vatican's Congregation for the Doctrine of the Faith. On this day in history, 1981, Pope John Paul II appointed him to this important position. Once known as the Roman Inquisition, the purpose of the Congregation for the Doctrine of Faith is, in the words of John Paul II, to promote and safeguard the doctrine on faith and morals throughout the Catholic world. As prefect of the congregation, Cardinal Ratzinger had to respond to various theological questions and only after discussions proved unsuccessful imposed disciplinary measures against dissident theologians. Though, of course, there is no burning at the stake involved. Perhaps the most famous document published by the congregation under Ratzinger's leadership was the Dominus Iesus, which strongly reaffirmed the Catholic teaching that it is Jesus Christ alone who saves, and only through the church that he established. Even though a person's faith in Christ and membership in the church might be merely implicit, the preservation of doctrine like this is a matter of the utmost importance, for it is only the truth, not popular opinion, that makes us free. Perhaps that is why as Pope and as Prefect for the Congregation of the Doctrine of Faith, Benedict XVI's motto has remained, co-workers of the truth.